Osman had, you know, something you, you didn't have, which is the ability to, to consult with the person that you're portraying. Can you talk a little bit, um, or she said you had something that Osman didn't have. And can you talk a little bit about what it was like to, uh, to connect with Paul Conroy for the book? Um, it was just such a, a privilege to be able to have that access and, um, you know, invaluable as an actor if the person you're portraying is, uh, is a constant presence on set. I mean, we've talked about this a few times, but Paul um, is quite a character and um, he came out to Jordan where we shot it, uh, supposedly for a week or two, uh, to sort of give us a bit of guidance and get us going early in the process and then he, we couldn't get rid of him. And we, had him uh, we had him there for the entirety of the shoot and actually he ended up becoming our stills photographer on the, on the set, which was um, quite trippy to be honest. Uh, but he was, uh, he's become a dear friend of mine now and, and I, I love him dearly and, and even from a practical point of view, you know, for Ross and I to be able just to mine his his brain to, to, to get every morsel of information about the situations those guys find themselves in. And it's obviously for me uh, doing his accent, uh, which is very, very far away from mine. So, um, you know, having him there the whole time was my version of Rose, you know, with her earbuds in uh, the phone. I could literally go and talk to the guy I'm playing. So I was pretty lucky. And Matthew, so what was it like?